Good morning, Jillison. Today, I am going to give you everything you need to know to successfully take the cable cars in San Francisco. So there are a lot of tourist activities in San Francisco that are total shit. But the cable car is actually really fun. It'll be the third time I've done it. And I'm doing it with friends today, one of which who has never been to San Francisco. So it'll be a good day. You have two options to get there. First option, take BART to Powell Street Station and start at that turntable. Second option, you're going to Fisherman's Wharf, which personally, I don't suggest, but that's where I'm meeting my friends, so it works out today. You're gonna wanna get off at Embarcadero. And then you're gonna do as I'm doing. You're gonna walk towards this giant building, cross the street, and hop on an F train. The F trains are really cute in themselves, so it's kind of fun. And then that's how you get to Fisherman's Wharf. And there's a turntable at Hyde and Beach. What are these turntables, you ask? Wait and see. I guess today they've got a market going on. They usually have something, so there's a lot of like vendors out. I can't remember what they call this thing. I'll put it on the screen. <laughs> I need to run. So to get to Fisherman's Wharf from Embarcadero, you get to hop on one of these cute things, which is the F line. And take it that way, which is to the left of this building. Oh, cool. Okay, so here's the turntable. Basically the car comes on here and then it's gonna turn on the turntable. And then you have to, he like put, move that thing with his foot and they have to do this by hand. And that's how they turn it around. It's pretty cool. Honestly, the wait for this car is pretty long, so bring your patience. <laughs> Might be like the cheesiest thing I've ever said on these vlogs. I goofed, and what we should have done, so for all you guys, buy your ticket, unless you have a flipper card, and then you're good. It's like $7 one way, $14 two ways, so as long as you have enough money on it. And then you can walk up the street a little ways to the next stop and get on there because they don't actually load this to the brim. We were stopped right here. This car is not even full, and it's because they're gonna be picking people people up along the way. Just watch the turntable once and then hike up the street, take it from the next one. Also, I highly recommend that you get one of these spots where you're hanging off the side if you are an adventurous person because it's super fun. Don't bring food or drinks on board, y'all. That's the Transamerica Pyramid. Here's a good San Francisco hill. No hands. Just kidding. Use your hands. Sometimes when you're leaning off the edge like that, they tell you to suck it in because you can actually like touch things that are like going by you basically. Union Square and we're almost at the end now so we got on back at Hyde and Beach and now we are at I think this is Powell and Market so this is the other area that you can get on the train at if you want to get on at a turntable space but like I said I really recommend that you don't do what we did and that you walk up just like one street and take it from a station just up there thanks for watching today guys I hope you have fun on your San Francisco adventure if you have any other questions leave it in a comment down below and stay tuned for more San Francisco travel guide videos okay bye Oh, 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 oh,